Hello there, and welcome to the test of your knowledge of the Rainbow Six Siege. I'll explain the rules and we'll get started. The questions have four categories of difficulty and you'll have 10 seconds to answer each question. In the end, you can find out who you are from the rainbow and share your achievement with your friends. Let's start. Easy questions, one point for each correct answer. Which pair of operators appeared in the Operation Black Eyes? Valkyrie and Blackbeard, Frost and Buck, Capitao and Cavera. Operation Black Ice is a Year 1 Season 1 operation released on February 2, 2016. This operation included new features like the Yacht Map, Spectator Mode and two favorite operators Frost and Buck. These operators still often appear in the pro scene. Which of the listed operators appeared in the game earlier? Maverick, Kide, Mose. Operation Green Sky, released in September 2018, included a new character called Maverick, a lightweight and fast operator fighting with a DIY blowtorch. Kite appeared in December of the same year, and Mosey appeared in 2019. Which gadget doesn't impose a slowdown effect? Goo Mines, Compound Z8 Remote Gas Grenade, Track Stingers. Z8 Grenade is a device that forms a cloud of gas when triggered. After activation, a gas cloud is released for 10 seconds, which causes damage to everyone, both opponents and allies, except for the device's owner, Smoke. Interesting fact, if Finca activates nanobots, operators' attackers will receive more damage from gas than usual. Medium complexity questions, two points for each correct answer. On which map can you select a point with the locations of the target on different floors and disarm bombs mode? Café Dostoevsky, Bank, Consulate. The Consulate map perhaps has the most unpopular point, choosing which you will have to protect both the basement and the first floor at once. These are the planet bombs at Tellers on the first floor, and archives in the basement. Still, you can always listen to great music in the basement. Which holiday was the reason for adding an event with this skin for Tachanka? Easter, April Fool's Day, Christmas. This event took place in 2019. Everyone remembered it for a brightly decorated presidential plane map, a hostage mode with a teddy bear, and acid pink skins for several operators. The reason for this event was April Fool's Day. What country's operator juggle from? Spain, Poland, South Korea. A native of Ceuta, Spain, Riyad Ramirez El Hassar, aka the Jekyll, specializes in tracking down the enemy and surviving in challenging conditions. He first appeared in Operation Velvet Shell with Mira in February 2017. Difficult questions, three points for each correct answer. Which pair of operators have the same weapon in their arsenal? Maestro and Fuse, Nomad and Ace, Mute and Amaru. Even though Nomad and Ace have Kalashnikov assault rifles, they differ in models. Nomad has an AK-74M and Ace has an AK-12. But both Mute and Amaru can take the SMG-11, a small submachine gun, into the second slot. By the way, Smoke also has SMG. Which operator was removed from the game several times because their shield was not working correctly? Montaigne, Clash, Blitz.
Despite several depressing modifications of Blitz, he always remained in the pool of operators. However, operator Clash was removed from the game several times due to the incorrect behavior of her shield, and returned after revisions. Which operator is missing from the Rainbow Six Extraction game? Maestro, Echo, IQ. Even though all these operators do not fit into the atmosphere of the game R6 Extraction at first glance, there was still a place for Eco and IQ here, which cannot be said about Maestro. Professional complexity questions, 4 points for each correct answer. What was the name of the operation with this soundtrack? Black Ice, Grim Sky, White Noise. It was written specifically for the Operation Grim Sky. On which map can you hear this track? Consulate, House, Bank. Rumor has it that the original song underlying this track is just like that by Zamil Samchiza. You can hear this song on the consulate map from a small radio in the garage. On which map can you hear this song? Consulate, Favela, Border. It was easy to assume that this is from Border or Favela maps, but I'm sure I'm not fooling anyone here. This track is also from the basements of the consulate. Well, our test is over. Now you can calculate your results and share them in the comments. But first, you need to decide who you are from the rainbow. If you scored 15 points or less, you're a recruit. You still have a lot to learn. Reach level 15, go to rating games because you must choose strong opponents to become stronger yourself. Keep your head up, big achievements await you. If you scored from 16 to 20, you're a clash. You already know your way around the map quite well. Sometimes you even manage to beat Ace. But to achieve great results, it's worth getting out of the places with planet bombs more often and trying a different styles of play. Perhaps you like roaming. If you scored from 21 to 25 points, then you are a true Ash. Oh, you're good. You've probably already found a couple of teammates or even a whole team to destroy the enemies. You're not afraid to move confidently on the map because only cowards fear Claymore. When you appear, the opponents stop choosing Amaru and switch to shield operators. I can only congratulate you on this level of knowledge. Diamond is just around the corner. Oh, and if you score 26 points or more, it means that you are Tachanka. You are a legend in this game. If you started playing later than 2015, you're a genius since you passed this test. It's scary to imagine how your rivals feel from your runouts and spawn picks. I feel sorry for them. Your KD is not less than a two-digit number, but you deserve more. I want to congratulate you on such achievements. Share in the comments how you achieved such success. That's it for today. See you later, operators!